It's exactly one week since a five-judge bench of the High Court rendered its judgment, terming the BBI bill as unconstitutional. The electoral body IBC is among the casualties in the case that suffer a setback besides the BBA proponents, President Uru Kenyatta and the opposition leader Raila Odinga. <laughs> they were full of Chebukati led team has now joined the aggrieved parties in contesting the ruling delivered by Justice Teresa Matheka, George Odunga, Joel Ngugi, Jira Singa and Chacha Mwita. In a notice of appeal already filed at the Court of Appeal, IBC is dissatisfied with the ruling of a lack of quorum uh, to carry out a referendum. IBC is also contesting the decision that it should have carried out mass voter registration uh, before conducting signature verification process. Uh, the court also questioned IBC about its role in the relation uh, to the verification that BBA bill should be supported uh, by at least one million signatures. Uh, Chebukati is also concerned about the ruling uh, that it should have provided a special legal framework of the signature verification process. Uh, Chebukati ruled out any crisis at the commission, uh, saying the Thursday ruling uh, gave them the stay orders to perform its mandate. Uh, currently, the commission has three commissioners out of the required nine. Uh, four of the commissioners reside under mysterious circumstances, and by now the electoral body IBC selection panel is in the process of filling up the gap. In the last media address, the panel said more than 700 Kenyans applied for the post of the commissioners. A BBA legal team filed its notice of appeal on Sunday. However, with the withdrawal of the stay order case, an application by the Attorney General at the High Court raised mixed reactions. It is said the legal team is contemplating on whether to have the same judges decide the fate of their stay order application or just move to the court of appeal. After they formally lodge an appeal, Wanjiru Karanja, who is now the acting president of the court of appeal, will be mandated uh, to form either a five or seven judge bench uh, to hear the appeal application. Uh, the calculation by the legal team uh, comes even as they wait for the swearing in of Justice Mother Kome as the Chief Justice. Uh, Kome was approved by Parliament on Wednesday and any time across the week uh, she will be sworn in as the Chief Justice where she will play a pivotal role in determining uh, the BBA bill case uh, should it land at the Supreme Court of Kenya, uh, the highest court on the land. Reporting for Ebro TV, I'm Jeff Haimba.